How's it going everybody? This is Beat the Bush. Today I'm going to review this Total Baby Playpen. The first thing that comes to mind is how safe is it? It conforms to the ASTM F406 standard consumer safety specification for play yards. So you can rest assured that it meets at least a certain standard of safety. Instruction manual, gripper things, a carrying case, a lot of connector pieces, the fabric covers, and the building pieces. They're all the same tubes, and you get 24 of them. 8T connector pieces, 4 corner pieces, and 4 corner pieces with these suction cups. Start by laying it out and there's a bottom fabric and there are four sides, each side with two of these tubes. Insert them all in there. Next, insert the vertical pieces. There are also eight vertical poles. The suction cups goes in the corner facing down and the T pieces goes in the middle. So I fit one like that. I've left connecting the corner poles for last. So now we're gonna do that. As soon as we do that, it's gonna stand upright. Now put in the horizontal poles in all eight positions. Now we have four corner pieces without the suction and four T pieces. I'm gonna start putting this one on. Just put them in one at a time. Now for the corner piece, put that in, fit them in that corner, fit the other corner in. You gotta pull it up a little bit because it's kind of tight here. The last two corners are particularly a tight fit. So I'm gonna show you how to do those. Find it easiest to step on the bottom corner. Pull up on this on one hand, and on the other hand, you grab this tube and pull out. There we go. Don't Velcro them all in place just yet until you've got all the tubes in place. Let's do this one. We pull it up. Pull this one in there. That took a lot. So now we can dress all of these and Velcro them into place. There's a bit of tension in there. So it's fitted very, very well and it's meant to be kind of tight all around. You can't actually feel the hard metal pole in the corner. It's actually very soft all the way up to the edge. From the inside corner, I can't actually feel the pole either. That's because the inner part is actually about an inch space from the actual metal frame. You might wonder how soft is this corner? If I fold it together, it feels like very thin foam and all along the bar here feels like even thinner foam. I'd say this is a little bit of padding, so it's not a direct metal pole. So let's say if I bump this, it does feel hard. Safety is a huge concern. There's a lot of warnings all over this thing. Never add a mattress, pillow comforter, or pad padding. Never leave your child unattended. You might be tempted to do that because, oh, they're confined in this area. You can run out for a bit. No, you can't. Over here is the same warning as this side. Look at all this warning. No one's gonna take responsibility for the safety of your baby. Ultimately, you have to be responsible yourself. Strangulation hazard play yard set up, keep all these instructions, infants can suffocate. The suction cups, of course, on carpeted floor doesn't really work. So this whole thing might lift off the ground. 52 inches across, it's a square 52 inches, and it's 26 and a half inches tall. It includes these little grabber things. So you put them on the edge, I guess, and it seems like the toddler can potentially pull this in order to get themselves up. Let me show you what it looks like on the other side, like that. Let's see if I close this door. Well, I guess if I'm crafty enough, I can use my finger and open it and ah, I'm out. So maybe if you really want to keep a baby in there, you got to lock this in place somehow. I guess this is kind of unfair because I'm 140 pounds or so. So if I roll this way, maybe I can topple it over. It's actually quite light. You can just lift up the whole thing, flip it over, and you see the bottom is actually slightly lifted off the ground by two inches. The suction cup, if you have hardwood floors, it would hold it in place. The floor that's slightly lifted off the ground makes it so that when the baby is inside, the edges actually cradles inward so the baby won't be standing right on the edge. After you're all done, you can fit all of this into a carry bag. Make sure you have all the pieces and just like that, packed and ready to go. If you guys are interested in this baby playpen, check out my Amazon affiliate link down in the video description below. Thanks for watching this video. Until next time. <laughs>